That is where we begin here at 6 o'clock. A pilot in critical condition after crashing his plane along the Broadway extension. That pilot, Dr. Richard Stanford, is a longtime pediatrician in the area. His plane crashed Sunday afternoon. Witnesses were horrified at what they saw along the busy interstate. News horse Adria Goins was at the scene as crews removed the plane today. She has new information on the investigation. Crew spent more than an hour here removing the wreckage of that small plane along Broadway extension. And News 4 has learned that NTSB investigators arrived late last night to determine what happened. A large crane lifting the white plane from the patch of grass where it crashed. NTSB investigators on site as pieces were removed. The pilot, now identified as Dr. Richard Stanford, was traveling from Sherman, Texas to Wiley Post Airport in Bethany, crashing down 10 miles from the runway, nicking power lines on the way down. We did see the power lines, um, and we did see the fire. We extinguished the flames, and then we began extrication, removing a patient from the plane. Oklahoma City Fire Captain Scott Douglas says the pilot told firefighters he lost power in the cockpit shortly before crashing, narrowly missing traffic just yards away. When I seen it, I was like, I know this ain't happening. And I looked over in that field, and I just started to praying, and tears started flowing down my eyes. I just, it was just crazy. Around 35 firefighters arrived within minutes, putting out a fire sparked by the wreck before using the jaws of life to pry the plane open and help Stanford, the only person on the plane. He was conscious whenever our firefighters arrived, so that was a good sign. He was alert. He was talking to us, so those are, those are good signs to us. NTSB will now examine the plane before releasing a full report. In Oklahoma City, Adria Goins, Oklahoma's News 4. It is quite a shock to see on the highway. Stanford remains in critical condition. He's been a pediatrician in the metro for 40 years.